Hello. Welcome to the segment of Under the Microscope. I'm Jeff Gold, and thank you so much for being with us today. I have the great pleasure of being joined by one of our graduate students, Catherine Woods. And Catherine is one of our doctoral students, uh, currently uh, in pathology and microbiology, about halfway through your degree, yes. right? But she's here with us today because she is one of the co-founders of GRADS. And of course, GRADS stands for Graduates and Professionals Representing Achievement, diversity, and service. Yes. Thank you so much for being with us Thank today. you for having me. Could you tell me and tell our audience a little bit about how the program was founded, why the program was founded? Yes. So myself and two of my actual best friends, um, but also colleagues, they, are both doc they were doctoral students, we got here to UNMC and kind of came from pretty diverse places. Two of us are from Atlanta and the other student was from um, Minnesota and so we arrived to campus and really just took in the environment and understood that you know it's pretty different from our hometowns and where we came from a little bit more diverse areas and places that we felt a little bit more uh, comfortable as far as just acclimating and getting used to the climate and everything so in wanting to help make that better for students coming behind us, we decided to create GRADS. Mm -hmm. And this is basically an organization that helps students to come into UNMC and have a place to feel comfortable, to know that their academic success is a priority, to have mentors and faculty that are there sure. to support them from day one. And so a part of creating it has helped me and my um, environmental ability to just be here and be present sure. and to succeed in my program as well. Well, we're so glad that you're doing it. Could you give us an example or two of uh, the types of things that you're thinking about doing? Yes. So actually, we've been um, in establishment for about a year now, and we've gotten to participate in some various different activities, one of which is that we have monthly meetings every um, month throughout the school year where we get together with all of the students and faculty members, and we serve lunch and host various topics um, of discussion, uh, just opportunities for student fellowship and interactions with faculty mentors. Very important thing to do. Yes, they are. Um, we also have done several different community service outreach um, projects where mm -hmm. recently we hosted a fundraiser for Grads and Girls Inc., the community mm -hmm. organization. Sure, we have a lot to do with Girls Inc. Yes, we are very excited to work with them. And the local band, Domestic Blend, hosted a fundraiser night where they put on a concert for us and all the proceeds for that show went to, went to split between Grads and Girls Inc. Wow. Yes. How exciting that so is. That was pretty fun. Well, we're really excited that you're doing this, and if there's anything that I can do and the Chancellor's Office can do to help, we would really like to be able to do that. Thank you so uh, much. Please extend our thanks to all of your colleagues who okay. set this up. Definitely. We're so glad that you're here. I guess this is a migration from Atlanta to Omaha yes, that we're yes. starting here, which is uh, really exciting. Yes. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Thanks for being so engaged. Thank you. And thank you for being with us today on this segment of Under the Microscope.